Good morning, everybody. It was last afternoon. Now that's between. It's been a week of miserable weather. Well, we needed the rain. And now Saturday and Sunday, it's going to be awesome weather. So, we're going out for a ride. Hope I don't blow myself out on the first day. Let's see. Right enough for today to keep some of the tank for tomorrow. No wind, no rain, and it's nice and warm. Hopefully I'll see some of you guys on the trail. If not, enjoy the video. Oh, it's so much fun. Kind of miss this. Pete's sitting at home wishing he could be going mountain biking. see anything too much yeah, too many tears in my eyes ah, that was funny ah, let's start again shall we I think I hit my knee ah, that was funny that's hilarious It's unbelievable the effect from not cycling. It cooped up and it's I didn't, I didn't know how to describe it. But I think it's more than just cabin fever. It's that urge to get out in the forest. Smell the 
wet ground, listen to the trees, wind blowing through the trees. I don't know, it's not cabin fever, it's more of a grave, an addiction that you need to feed. I suppose it's a healthy addiction. Um, also, I suppose when you're cycling and mountain biking, you are in the moment, there's nothing else that bothers you yet. You can't afford to concentrate on something else other than what you're doing right now. It helps you escape, you know, the tough parts of the week. You know, it leaves behind all the politics and you need to concentrate on what you're doing. It helps your mind relax as if it's like a little holiday. My, my wife always says, I'm a much better person after I come back cycling. And you know, when you think about it, it's true. Because I got to exercise, got to do something that I love, and I get to relax my mind, de-stress, declutter, open up some you know, areas that was closed down due to stress. Looks a bit better that way, I think, for everybody. After all this conversation about how mountain biking makes you feel, it almost sounds very spiritual in a way. <laughs> Mumbo jumbo stuff. But it's true, it makes you feel at peace, centers yourself. I like riding by myself. It doesn't hurt riding with other people. But riding by yourself, you can't ever sort yourself out in a way. Don't spook the pooch. Come for it. Come for me. Hello, baby. <laughs> Thank you very much. Enjoy. The most winter you can ride indoors. Well, where's the fun in that? It goes monotonous after a while as well. Damn the gutters. Here goes my pedal. Broke a chain. <sighs> yeah, but I love that one. Alright, after fixing that issue, we'll have to get a new chain and new gloves. <laughs> Thank goodness I have tools, right? Eh? 
So when I hit that rock, that actually snapped my chain. I knew something was not right. Oh well, I needed new cleats, new chain anyway. And my gloves are worn. Time for upgrades. Pain and pleasure. Pain and pleasure. All this climbing it pays off of then a short while actually. This is cock steep. I'm waiting for the pleasure part. Uh. Doesn't get any easier, I tell you that. You can do as many interval trainings you want indoors still doesn't constitute or replace that real riding. Such a beautiful day. The views are incredible. Unbelievable. Gecko. <laughs> ah, so I tried dropping my saddle and um, almost saw my eye a few times. Right. <laughs>
sand. them. Sorry monkeys. Yes. <laughs> What an awesome day of riding it was. Um, it was hot, rutted because of the rain, obviously, and um, beautiful weather, no wind, and I rode to the best of my capability and blew myself, so I don't know how I'm going to ride tomorrow. Uh, I also, I heard by one o'clock today at the Glen, uh, which is in town, someone sabotaged the route and put a wire across, and the guy got hurt. That's criminal. And I don't see why people can't share the, the trails, the routes with other people. Today I saw an old lady also, grumpy, didn't want to move out the way. And another old guy says, so many of you. But in retrospect, it wasn't so many of us. The trails would be a lot unsafer. But yet again, we can be kind to one another. And also think, if all can work together, make the trails safe, uh, be friendly and then everybody will be happy slow down for horses slow down for people with dogs kids be friendly to the dogs um, and everybody would be happy hope you guys had an awesome sun uh, saturday uh, saturday yeah saturday and um look after yourselves be safe this is me out and from the kitty